if this technology were real, why would you do any of these things? If this was a real breakthrough, why bother dealing with the hassles of turning your invention into consumer technology or founding a micronation? You, you could make money from it directly. If Maxwell could create energy from nothing, then he wouldn't need to sell this device. He would just sell the energy. He would rent a warehouse and fill it full of these macrosonic energy generators. He would connect that warehouse to the grid and simply watch the Zimbabwean dollars accumulate. If you had a free energy device, the last thing you would ever do would be to tell the world about it, because it would be like revealing the location of your diamond mine. So what have we learned? We didn't need to debunk Maxwell Chikambozzo's claims in detail. We don't need to analyze his technology. We don't need to travel to Zimbabwe to investigate whether any of this stuff was real, because the nature of his scam was so obvious from the beginning. And it wasn't because of my insight into high energy physics, nor my decades of working as an engineer. It was obvious because we know how these stories work. A free energy scam is not a scientific breakthrough. It is a genre of fiction. And anybody who knows that genre's markers can spot it a mile away. It's easy to spot because the tropes never change. The names differ, the locations vary, and the details get a, a contemporary facelift. But all of the genre markers, all of the tropes are always identical. We saw it with Stiorn, we saw it with Sasha Stone, and we're going to see it with Maxwell Chikambozzo. That's why we don't have to take anything he says seriously. That's why we don't have to debunk every single detail of this fake invention. Because once you recognize that's what it is, you know the function of the story, and you know how this story always ends. It's the same way that it ended for Stuorn, for Sasha Stone, and for every free energy grifter that came before. It's a big promise, a wave of hype, and then absolutely nothing. Uh,